Welcome back to you and me. Vlogs. <laughs> Everybody's <laughs> together one last time here. <laughs> wow. Well, um, well, what exactly are we doing? What, what are we on the vlog channel for? Well, we're on the vlog channel for our Christmas haul. Oh, the what we got Christmas haul for Christmas. What did we, what did we get for Christmas? 2021. Well, let me tell you. Christmas did not disappoint. Mm -hmm. Uh So, how do you want to do this? You want to start with you? You want to start with me? You want to go back and forth? What do you want to do? We'll go back and forth. All right. Well. So, welcome to the Christmas Wonderfest. This is all our friends here. It started on the Board Game Channel, so go check that out to get caught up on how... Yeah, you have to figure out what's going on here on the, the set. Whole, this whole thing. Over here. But, Sammy! Thanks for a good Christmas. You're welcome, my friend. And Santa back there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And Buddy was really excited. Really excited for Christmas. You know, Buddy... Buddy really outdid himself. Yep. You know, he came in and decorated the place up and... Made it his own. Anyway. Rented the studio. Anyway. <laughs> let's let's All start right. here. Alright, let's see what you got. Let's see what you got first out of, out of your uh, stack of Christmas gifts this year. Uno Flip. Yep. Different twist to Uno. It's like, flip it over and there's... Yeah, you could... Turn the game Double -sided upside cards. down, literally, and yeah. do a whole different uh, game to it. You know, switch that out. I've got something interesting. I got I, at first. I didn't realize what it was. Now, this is the Star Wars Empire versus Rebellion, but it's actually a card game. Card game. It's a card game, so it'll be interesting to see um, how this works out and everything. But uh, it's. Just, it's, uh, looks like it's back in, like, episode four, five, and six, I think it awesome. is. Awesome. That's the best the part. Classics. Best one. So that's the best, that's the best out of the whole Star Wars series. So probably because you got Obi-Wan, uh, you got uh, Han Solo, you have Luke Skywalker, so Boba Fett. So it's in that same, I'm saying four, five, and six, because those are the characters are showing. But I don't know if there's any more in there or not. We'll have to find out, but. It's a strategy card game for two players, so it's actually a two an actual two player game. Two. Uh -huh. So that's interesting. Over here, we have the Jurassic Park novel. I really like this cover. Oh. The nice leather. That's cool. It's really cool. I like how it's like etched in. Mm -hmm. You know, the detail on that is really cool. Oh, it says collector's edition on the side mm -hmm. of it. On the um, what is that called? Um, the, the neck spine. of the book? The spine. The spine, that's it. I knew it was something like that. Book nerd. Yeah. yeah. Um, well, my my gifts kind of went from a different turn from that card game to a whole different theme altogether. Um, what do I start with? We'll start with this, I guess. I've got a Zelda uh, Switch, Nintendo Switch controller. Uh, really love. I like the that. chrome on the. I like that chrome. That's one of my favorite touches. Yeah, I'm afraid to like hold it on. Get my fingerprints over it. It's so shiny mm -hmm. right now, but it's a Zelda um, Pro Control Pro style wireless uh, controller, which is really cool. Uh, I like the wireless that way. I mean, you have to get tangled up in the cords and all that stuff, except for charging mm -hmm. purposes, obviously, but. Yeah, I'd rather have the battery ones. I, I don't like where it goes wireless, but it's like, oh, when it dies, it becomes wired. I'm sorry, guys. Okay. Yeah. Uh. So. All right, all right. All right, so he's showing you something that he got. So go right ahead. Big boy. New OLED switch. The OLED switch. So that's the this switch is uh, enhanced with a bigger screen. I think it's a seven inch screen. Um, it has an uh, different approach LAN, to the yeah. It's a different uh, to the tabletop mode. Tabletop mode flip out instead of being one little stem. It's the whole back 
under back side of it. Maybe we can do a review on this. <laughs> we might. We might still have to do an it. unboxing on that one because that one's still un, uh, still boxed up. Um, and then later on, I got or a different gift. I got this one. This is a Mara one. This is really cool. I like this. It's also a, a handheld um, wireless controller. I like the the uh, the pipe. The look. pipe. Mm. It's kind of cool. It's like you're coming out of a pipe. And it's got the um, vine coming out of it and some coins there. So that's interesting. I like how that looks. It's so like it's a sleek design. Too bad it doesn't open up to really get a look at it like mm. that one does. But those have the cool chrome, so <laughs> they're like, yeah, it's not worth it. <laughs> yeah, it's a different. Uh, Oh, I still like it. I mean, yeah. don't get me wrong, but anyway, what'd you uh, get there? You know, Deucin here with his food. Got what? the cute food cute advanced food? coloring book. Which oh, it's a coloring book. Cute, okay. cute food kind of well, gives it the wrong approach there because it makes it, it seem like it's be, yeah. cartoonish, like those yeah, that's what they mean, like, Japanese style, like, like the ones with the eyes and the face. But this is like realistic. Yeah, they just so like calling it like the cute food kind of. Threw it off there, but this one I really like with the wings. Oh, that is that cool. That's a nice one. The burrito. Do we see a uh, nachos ooh. and cheese? Do we see a, uh, a, a a series coming along and over on your personal channel, maybe? Speed art. <laughs> yeah. Speed art. Yeah. <laughs> um. Well, let's let's do this. Uh, I too did get a. Uh, an OLED switch. I'll go ahead and open this up so you can see what it looks like. Uh, I got the case separately as well, so it's two different gifts in one right here. Uh, this case is a little different than uh, the other ones, but this is a really nice switch. I love it. I got a fingerprint on it a little bit. Look at that. Um, I got the case, these protective cases. That are on it as well as in, as you get that came with this. This came with this uh, four game holder. You put the cartridges in it, and I just dropped my mini SD card cartridge holder, so you can put my mini SD in there if I wanted to, or an extra one. I don't have it yet. I have to get that for it, so I would have one for it. Then also came with the the case. It anyway it came with uh, the official Nintendo Switch. Um, cloth wipe to keep the screen uh, clean. Um, the switch has a input. On this and then on the Joy Cons, you got the oh, it extra on the base. In the back. Yeah, the Joy Cons are. Uh, I guess on the base, but there is a um, LAN input, so you can actually stick your your uh, LAN cable cord right into. The switch and mm -hmm. have the fastest speed gameplay on it. Oh heck yeah! So that's what the next updated version of this switch is. It has that to it, and also has the bigger screen. So the screen is from the traditional. I think it was like a five inch. I think it's the seven inch now, yeah. or four inch screen to a seven inch. I can't remember what the different ratio of it is, but uh, and then this right here is really cool. It folds out, and you can actually oh, have a stand upgraded. built in it. There's no cover, there's no like little slots, but I'll show you what this does here. Improvements to their cases. This is a little different model case to it, but this will pop out. And you can stick it right into the, the bottom of it there, or the top of it. And you can literally play with your switch on your case like that. There we go. So that's really cool. It's different, more compact, sleeker design than it has the space for your games on the bottom instead of on top uh it does protect it pretty snug so i do like that about it you put that right back in there like that oops yeah but it's like a little kid on christmas well that one went I'm straight into you. it so we got a we got a sealed one so that's just since, then, that's, since it was open i might as well show you what yeah, this case yeah. came with so now you got the sealed one and then the and we'll go with the, the we'll do a the unboxing of the what looks like in the box and there's no handle on that one it's just this right here that's only to me downside. I'm used to doing the big handle on the top of it. Mm -hmm. It's just that hanging. Duh. 
So a little little uh, of course. pros and cons with it. Of course, it, you, you got know? upgrades yeah, and then you got exactly. yeah, I don't like that. I like it. <laughs> It's got the pros and cons. That's cool, but then you have the... It's got one, the, the other one that it doesn't have. It's... Yeah. I went to grab it one time. I was like, wait a minute. There's no handle there. It's just this. Uh, uh, I'll stick with the old one then. Yeah. <laughs> I don't need that fancy tip thing. I'll, I'll rather have the handle I can carry it with. <laughs> Spider-Man. The ultimate guide to Spider-Man. So is that a magazine or is that a... Magazine. So it's like a, just a whole book about Spider-Man. Ultimate okay. God. And it's got that first look at No Way Home. Oh. Which I have not seen, so no spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> now the now the comments are gonna be flooded with No Way Home now. Spoilers, because we mentioned that. Oh well. <laughs> oh, let's if you haven't seen it by now. <laughs> yeah. I got uh, a couple of games, a few games actually, for my uh, Switch. I got uh, WWE 2K Battlegrounds. It's a fun game. If you've not played it, uh, play it. We might do some reviews on these later mm -hmm. on. Uh, maybe some pl uh, playthroughs or something. Video game channel. Boop, right yeah. there. Go check so it out. You might, might see that coming up. So. You just go through. You just go through. All right. Then I have. Uh, Ice Age, Scraps, Nutty Adventure. This is going to be an interesting one for the uh, gaming channel. Yeah, you know, play through and all that it, stuff. It looks what it looks like Crash Bandicoot, but Ice Age. So his basically the premise of the game is he's lost his beloved acorn, mm. and you have to collect the jewel acorns to find this location. Mm -hmm. But there's so many different the game. So they made a whole game out of the beginning of the movie. Basically. Wow. Out of that little gag, became a whole game. Oh, it did. Wow. <laughs> we have Wheel of Fortune and Jeopardy. Oh, you got me interested now. I'm really interested in wanting to see how this works, so it's one of my uh, intriguing ones. We also have Star Wars Pinball. I'm really excited to see how that works, see how that plays. A lot of these I have not opened up yet. They're still in the plastic. You got the Harry Potter, the whole collection. Complete collection. There's two different. Uh, they usually, uh, in some some instances, they put one pack out and then another pack. This is a double pack. So I got two different games, as they're calling it, two classic games. Yeah, and all one the different cartridge. years. But it's this is five through seven, and this is the one through three. It's the remastered from the Wii. Mm hmm. Yeah, remastered for Nintendo Switch. Um, so what's so what's I play a little that. bit of the Wii version, so I can't wait to see yeah. how it looks on yeah. the Switch. It's still gonna have that classic Lego. Oh, of course. You know, where they don't talk and they just grunt. And... This one is Monopoly. This is a <gasps> Game Nights. Monopoly. Monopoly for Nintendo Switch. This is Risk and Trivial Pursuit. So that mm -hmm. one's interesting. I can't wait to play that one. And then I have Hotel Transylvania Monsters Overboard. Oh, not Hotel Transylvania 3, Monsters Overboard. Looks like an interesting game. Can't wait to see how that plays and everything. We have a classic here. Travel games. Brought can't, back remastered can't. ones from the Wii. Yeah. Um, <coughs> I guess another updated version of the game. I think we showcased something like this on the video game yeah. channel already. And then the lastly, Wii Carnival games. on my stack of games here, we have Sonic Mania. Um, doesn't say much about which games are on it. It just has uh, three playable characters with unique abilities. So I guess it's Sonic. Oh, we did that one on the... Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles. And then New Stages, Classic Zones... Um, and you can join a friend in competition mode. So. We did that one on the gaming channel as well yeah. on the Xbox version. Yeah. Oh yeah, we did that on the Xbox version. So this is the Switch version, so I don't know if it's going to be any different or if it's going to be the same. But that's all the games I got. Well, I'm wearing one of my gifts, actually. I got an outfit. Uh, comfortable yeah, my, outfit for nighttime. The, these um, are like the highlights, like minus like shampoo and... Pajamas, slippers. The typical Christmas gifts. Yeah. yeah. So, but this is the, the fun stuff. Yeah. All right, let's dip into uh, okay. Deucen's side okay. of the fun okay. stuff okay. now. Okay. So, 
th- this is what I like about the the Christmas hauls is it, it's kind of like a Christmas present to the viewers as well because it gives them something excited. It gives them a little uh, sneak peek if upcoming you will, for uh, what's, what's coming coming for the year. So stay tuned yeah. on the board game channel. Board game channel's gonna get a lot of love here soon. We well, so. just hit hundred subscribers by the way. So thank you guys oh, we're for gonna that. be doing a special for that video coming out later. About that. Thank you for tuning in and doing what you do and giving for us a hundred over there. Yep. I seen this. Yeah. I was freaking out I like when I this. seen it, and I didn't have the money to buy it. So the I'm glad you got it. Target exclusive, Target edition, <laughs> Monopoly. It's, it's got little grocery carts, little grocery baskets. I guess you put your little shopping items in your basket. It's amazing. Hold. Yeah, that's cool. That's a cool uh, touch. Definitely some twist in here because there's like a lot of tokens and oh, uh, tokens and money. Debit card. You got the red you card. The times two coins over here too. So yeah, this two, is not a normal three. version of Monopoly. What? Okay, interesting. We'll have to see what that's like. Awesome. What that's about. Here you go. House, House divided. divided. This is one that we tried to get for, for our President's Day special. President's Day special and. Of course, when we look for it, you can't find it. When you don't that find whole week, it, yeah. you find it. That, that whole week, we're <laughs> like, oh, we need to do the President's Day special, go out and get it, and then it's like, <laughs> not there. So. It's usually how that goes. You look for something that's not there, but then when you go back to it, and you're not looking for it. Oh, there it is. Yeah, so but he got it as a Christmas present. Instead, coming so. 2022, yeah, President's Day. Fun to see. Uh, the Lion King Monopoly. The Lion King Monopoly. It's going to be interesting. Yeah, it's kind of like the Ghostbusters one where it's in that fold box and it has oh, the, it the has noise. The, yeah, it's one of the um, last set of Monopoly games that came out where they had musical boxes yeah. with the games and stuff. And now that they're doing the... What is it now they're on? Just, I don't remember now. It's not right. I don't think there really is any. Right yeah, I don't remember now. Back to normal. But yeah, this is not my favorite type of boxes for Monopoly. Yeah. This is how they released them with those music. I oh, like the gold tokens. Rock is what makes the music. Okay. Yeah, you and got I guess the, that's where the cards sit inside yeah. Pride Rock. That's kind of a cool touch. You got the Ghost Trap and the Ghostbusters one. Yeah. There you go. And then that just that just does the opening Circle of Life music. Every time you pass go, can you want to hear that? All right, we have newest edition of Monopoly for a loot crate. Night. Monopoly right. Fortnite Collector's Edition. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's cool. That's going to be interesting to see how that's going to work. Oh, there's a... Uh, I noticed this. There's a... Uh, yeah, there's no more cardboard. No more cardboard. Look at the people you're actually moving around. And they actually got piece. our tokens now. Yeah, that's good. That's a good upgrade, too, because I needed that. But it's not 27 of them now. <laughs> no, it's only 10. So... So, I guess you could use the other ones if you wanted to. Yeah. But no, we've got metal tokens but, now. But you got yeah. the tokens, so it makes it better. I'm yeah. just saying, I, yeah. if you really like it, if, it, if it, we can't really see which characters they are. If you want a different one, then yeah, continue with those old ones there. Right. But that's cool that these are not cardboard tokens anymore. It looks like rubber, maybe plastic. Yeah, probably it's kind plastic. of hard to tell what And that then you've got we'll the metal out. token. So yeah. that's cool because I did mention in a video, I was like, we need another edition of Monopoly Fortnite. And there we go. New set. Even has a code. To get the Monopoly back blings in the game. Oh, cool. So cool code. Get that set there. Oh, I, and, and before you go on to the next one, I did put Fortnite on my... All right, there we go. So I'll be playing Fortnite here soon. So be watching for my, for, for my gamer tag or, or even, even gaming on there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Monopoly, Monopoly Builders. Builder. This is another one that intrigued me that I seen at one time. I was intrigued by it. Gather, trade resources, and choose a plot. Of land and build. Okay. So I guess like your property like has like a here. little. Oh, that's cool. Has a little like you gotta follow something where your what your prop, plot of land is, and you can actually build up on that property. Huh. Kind of reminds me like a skyscraper. It's kind of like the look. This looks like kind of like a twist between, um, what's that game? That Monopoly game, Empire and. Uh, yeah. Cityville or something. Cityville, that's what it was. Yeah, yeah. that reminds me of Cityville here. Yeah, which we have, but we have it. We just haven't done it on the channel yet. So that's yeah, still, that one, that's that still one has a history. Soon. That one's a, a vaulted video. Yeah. Like this, a Harley Quinn gift set. Harley Quinn and Mister J. 
That is cool. Got some tokens down here, some earbuds and some hangers. That's very that's cool. What's that? Just hang? hang from the rope. Oh, holds on to the earbud. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. They just kind of like hold on like they're holding on like a rope. Yeah. That's pretty neat. It's awesome. Solar powered as well. Oh, the bobblehead solar powered? Or the direct light, yeah. Hmm. Body knocker. Body it's knocker, whatever it's called. Excited to get to. It's a party game for two players? What? Two to seven? Finally, some party games for two. Made for two instead of three, yeah. yeah. So we'll be able to see party this. Game. This is a wallet. This is called Wallet. I've never heard of it. Wallet. Uh, have you heard of it? No. I'm but now I really want to yeah, hear about it some more. The artwork's intriguing. Mm. It, it's got that, this old, uh, or a, not really old, but more like I mean, a... Uh, we've heard of, the, heard of this. Like we got games from Cryptozotic, but yeah. I've never heard of Wallet before. Yeah. Let's see what the back side looks like real quick. So, looks like some money's in play. You got some card. Use the wallet and stay cards. out of jail. Oh, interesting. Okay. Hmm. That's interesting. I'll be, we'll be able to see, see that later on. Stay out of jail. Yeah. So Monopoly Christmas this year. All right, we got Monopoly Arcade. Pac-Man. Pac-Man. It was a little machine. Rack up the most points. I wonder what, what how the uh, arcade machine, how that affects the game. The play. arcade is the banking unit. What the? Okay. okay. So that's the bank thing. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. Play the arcade every time you pass go. Oh no, do you have to play to get your 200? Oh no. Probably. Oh no. Probably. Win. win. Pay to win to get your 200 to pass to go. Here's the game travel case. The deluxe system? Ooh. He's got an updated version of his travel case that he has. Awesome. There we go. For the new... Uh, OLED. <laughs> Switch. Speaking of wallet. A wallet. Real Ooh, wallet. No wallet. What's that hanging right next New to it there? It's a belt. Oh, oh, the belt clip. Oh, it's a belt clip. Awesome. Leather key fobs. So you can put your keys on there. Amazing. That's cool. You can scrap that to your keys and walk around the wallet. Walk around the wallet and the keys. Okay, here's Jots. Protective case. Nintendo Switch not included. Oh. Was it in there? <laughs> Was well, long enough, isn't it? Mm. What's the back of it look like? Okay, so I guess it's the uh, the shells out here, the colors and this black part. So it's like a hard cat, mm. hardback case for is what it is. The clear cases. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it's on the Joy Cons there. Yeah. It's kind of like what was shown on the Switch there earlier. Yeah. LED light bar. So he's got another one of those, so... Horizontal and vertical mounting. Yeah, you can do it both ways. Yeah. Amazing. He's got one of those already for his... Uh, for in, in his room, in his, More gaming, color, the his video gaming setup. Uh, he's got one of those. More color, the better. Yeah. So. Sharpies. That's going to be good for planning. Planning and such, yeah. New video ideas with these Sharpies. Puppy calendar. A puppy calendar. There we go. Sharpies for playing. <laughs> you know, I'm kind of glad it's a puppy. Yeah. More, more of a dog kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> this one's intriguing. Bird spotting Opoly. Masterpieces. Oh, the masterpieces. Okay. Another masterpiece. So it's a collector's edition set. It's got the different birds, Another I guess, it looks like. Well, not, well, one of them's not a bird. It's actually binoculars. But, uh... That'd interesting. Be interesting. Maybe one coming up for spring. Maybe, yeah. Open up spring with birds falling off of it. Yeah, it's sad. A gamer. A Monopoly gamer? gamer. Uh, Battle for the highest score. So, we have one like this. <laughs> Um, Mario Kart. So that's the Mario Kart version. And in this one here, you actually, the characters, instead of them, the characters in the cart. Um, so, and they got different Mario levels there. Uh, those Bowser cards. Or boss cards, what's it called? Oh, lighting. Um, no. 
Monopoly Gamer Jehoozer. Well, Joe see, here. it's um, they've made this game where it's bilingual, so you both have mm-hmm. English and I think it's Spanish. I think it's Spanish, but all the spaces have two different uh, languages on it, so uh, it's for both languages. That's what it's made for. So your car is probably going to have extra writing on it, your all that stuff. So uh, unfortunately, that's why it's got two different writings on it. Or gamer, um, Jower, excuse, Jower, however, I, I probably butchered that. Don't, 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 so, don't be so mad. Uh, no, English I, speakers. I'm not a very good <laughs> Spanish speaking person. I know Piquito. <laughs> Monopoly Space Jam. Monopoly Space Jam, a new <laughs> legacy. Uh, yes, you see that right. There is a basketball hoop you have on your board to uh, wow. play while playing Monopoly. So it's 2 1. I wonder if we have to make it into the hoop to get the two hundred dollars. Oh great! So get two hundred if you make it from the three point and free throw. Yeah. You got to shoot the ball as you pass go. Great. Puts it in the space. Interesting. Okay. I was curious about that. And that's what it is. So that's gonna be interesting. This seems like one for the new year. <laughs> A New Year one so yep. might be coming up soon here. Monopoly um, jackpot. This Monop- Monopoly jackpot. Uh, I actually found this, and I was real excited to see this uh, when I seen it. Um, it's literally a roulette wheel. Um, so the whole gameplay is different. Um, you still have the dice and everything, and the houses and all that, but the spinner is <laughs> in the middle. <laughs> And it's got extra stuff on it. You know, you spin the whole arrow thing in the middle, and whatever happens, happens, I guess. Um, each player has their own color. Houses, it looks like. I'm assuming. That's interesting. So, a lot of new twists and turns on this. It's only $100 bills. There's no other money. Oh, well. Because it's... you got to be in it to win it. Interesting. I don't know how that's going to work. We'll have to find out. But that looks pretty interesting. I saw that. Monopoly. <sighs> fan that? edition. Only the true fans. <sighs> can play the trivia game here. Woohoo! 25 years. No! Oh. <laughs> Simpsons game. We are way past that now, though. Wow. Way past 25 that's years like now, though. That's edition right there, bro. Yeah. That's definitely a collector's edition. Do you even want to open that? Oh, do I? Do I? Do I? Like, 100% official. Exactly. Like, do you really want to open that? Mm-hmm. It's pretty good condition, too. It could be valuable someday. Well, there you go. <laughs> Not coming to the channel. I'm not ready. Scooby Doo's here with this pop and race game. Another pop and race. He, he, uh, he likes to play some of these sometimes. The trouble style game. Yeah. There we go. Scooby Doo edition. Rahamic. Rum Ham Rub. No, oh, it's a Rummy Cube. Rummy Cube. Rummy Cube. Like the game you play, Rummy. Mm-hmm. A card game. But it's a uh, tile base. That's a really fun game. I played this. Uh, and you'll you'll enjoy it once you get the hang of how it's played and everything. The smiley face is a wild, so you can have four of a kind or Scary. whatever. So, yeah. That's what that is. So, y'all heard of Throw Throw Burrito? Well, this is its sister or brother. Throw avocado. Throw avocado. Uh. What's really cool about this is that this game uh, can be combined, combined with Throw Throw Burrito. Make a new game. And you can unlock a new combo game. There we go. That's there cool. It's like a food coming. So in. throw throw burrito avocado, coming soon maybe. Throw burrito burrito avocado avocado. Yeah. Mix so, the cards with other ones. Interesting. It's the same the same concept. We just throw in the avocado instead of the burrito. So two to six players party game. Uh, 
smoking noises. I'm guessing that's the cards? Or is it the... I mean, if you could get that cards. and bite that off, yeah. Yeah. That, I think it's fun. I seen that. I seen the, the combo. I was like, that's neat. So you can go back. You can Bond bring out the old... Uh, throw throw a burrito and actually have a new gameplay on Still it. Still use it. Everything. Yeah. Bring everything to use. The Candyland Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory edition. So makes sense to make this. Yeah, it does. And it's the this is the the classic Willy Wonka. It's, this is the the new one with yeah. Charlie Char the Chocolate Factory. Johnny Depp one. No, this is the this is the classic one. Um, go back to box. Yeah, a lot of games that they just slap branding on and it doesn't make any sense. But this one, yeah, makes sense. Okay, so. Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory, and you're going around the board as Oompa Loompas. Well, there you go. So... Going through the Chocolate Factory as an Oompa Loompa. Cards look like Wonka bars. That's a cool touch. I do like that. Um... So, basically, you're doing exactly what the movie says. You got the golden ticket. Now you get two of the... the, the the factory. But we're Oompa Loompas, though, so we're already in the factory anyway. Huh. So it says, congratulations, you have a golden ticket to tour Willy Wonka's World Famous Chocolate Factory. Visit huh. the inventing room and move past the lickable wallpaper to the fizzy lifting drink silo. Be careful not to be late for that bad egg and be sent down the educator, too. She was a bad egg. <laughs> be lucky enough to get a short shortcut ride on the Wonka Tania or through the air by Wonka Vision. Most of all, get ready to enter a world of pure imagination. Well, there we go. But yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's like we got the golden ticket, so we should be like you know Charlie Bucket and that still yeah and that still makes characters. sense to use the kids as and Candyland because yeah. you got the gold ticket, you know. But it oh, gave we're moving around the board as Oompa Loompas instead, instead of just the same. So the Oompa Loompas get a golden ticket too and <laughs> stay. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> <laughs> the backstory of the Oompa Loompas. There's actually, I kid you not, there's actually another Willy Wonka Why? movie getting, getting ready to come out. Why? But it's just simply called, it's going to be called Wonka. And it's going to be his younger mm. years. Oh, well, there we so go. it's like a prequel to what we know of. I guess he's playing Wonka in uh, this movie. Uh, not Johnny Depp. Uh, Somebody else. Somebody else. Somebody younger, obviously. Chris Pratt, since he's doing everything all, <laughs> all of a sudden, no. Since he's doing everything um, now. <laughs> no, I believe it's actually do good. People do good with this casting. I'm not mistaken. I think it's Tom Holland. Oh, what? Uh, yep. Okay. What do we got here? All right, we have Monopoly Crooked Cash. Crooked Cash. Buying the fake cash. To make your fortune. They made a game where there's actually fake, fake money. With the, with the magnifying glass and everything. Decoder. Oh, okay. Call it the decoder. So we got a decoder ca uh, cash in his cards, it looks like. This is going to be interesting. Kind of maybe like a remake game of Cheaters, uh, edition. Cheaters edition, but just with fake cash. Well, okay, well what if you play Cheaters Edition? I feel like that could be a cool combination. They, see, Monopoly could do the combination oh there. Oh, my if you word. Play Cheaters Edition with the Crypt Cash. Yeah. So, yeah. they like to... Oh, i seen this. They I turned all their games into card games, and they're like, well, we did the card games, and Mumble well make dice games now, too. <laughs> yep, I got that. I thought that was interesting. It's a uh, clue dice. I got, him, I got that for, his, uh, for one of the presents for Christmas. And after I got this, uh, I went back to the store where I got it from, and in the same place that was, they replaced it with Monopoly Dice. Oh, there you go, Monopoly Dice. So there's a trend of board games that are being diced. Don't know how you're gonna do how that works out, but they still find some way to do it. Still so that's interesting. All right, so this is perfect for the blog, not the blog channel, but the game channel, but the collectibles part of the game channel. Monopoly Surprise. Uh, we mentioned that we were going to um, ten off of possibly get some more. Well, he got those in for Christmas, so yeah. There we go. Now we have more collectible content. See them open on Yumi Borgen. Um, 
rare tokens to find, it says. It's going to be interesting. We'll still need a few of those, so. All right, this is something he was excited about. Love this. He's really into Suicide Squad and Harley Quinn and all that. So, so. we got Birds of Prey and the long, real long title of Anticipation of Harley Quinn. There you go. <laughs> the really long, <laughs> fabulous Anticipation of one Harley Quinn. That, that's shorter. It, was, it used to be longer than that, but there's the Suicide Squad down there. Yep. Ah. Jingo with his uh, board game stack over there. Yeah. We got Uno. This the remix. So Uno remix. Customized cars. Personalized cars. cars. Control the game. Control. The Control. Game. Interesting stuff Interesting. there. Interesting. I don't know what that's about. We'll have to figure that out. What if there's customizable cars? In it? Ah, okay. All right. That's still too heavy for that spot. Oh, there's that even. Ah, yeah, that even. But Okay. Elf on the Shelf matching game. What? They got a matching game for it now? They got a matching game? Because cause why not? The elves wanted so it's a matching 18 game. 18 sets of cards, so the guest cards aren't as um, small as others, maybe? I don't know. There we go. Matching game. We'll find Probably out. Probably coming up for the winter. Winter yeah. Wonder Fest. Winter, winter Fest. <laughs> There we go. Coming up for the winter test. Split Pad Pro. So he's got some updated uh, Switch Pad. So it's like the a Pro Controller. But a Pro version. Controller for your Joy-Con, basically. Amazing. Yeah. The I guess you slip them over your Joy-Cons and you have more comfortable... Yeah, oh, that did it, that did it, that did it. Oh, that did it, that did it. Oh! Okay, well, there you go. If you have a huge tower, don't put, this, uh, don't, don't put the Split Pad Pro on top. <laughs> now we know the limit. We know the limit. <laughs> okay, this one I'm excited about. Monopoly Deadpool. Deadpool? Collector's Edition. It's, it's shiny, that's how you know. <laughs> Wait a minute. You know it's special because it's shiny. You know what's special when uh, the, the box has a crease right down the middle all the way around. So I bet you... It opens from the top like it opens that. from the top like There that. you go. Yep. Oh, it's a milk and paper still on it. Oh, Bonus. Well, I'm not going to take it off because I won't ruin it any more than it is. Could get, I should say. Yeah, so a Deadpool version of Monopoly. There we go. Seen the original, didn't know there was a collector's edition, so even better. Yep. More stuff in there. Pretty heavy box, too. Yeah, it is. That's a tradi uh, that's a unique box. It opens mm -hmm. off the top like that instead of like traditional boxes that open like. Yeah, I'm pretty. I don't know if the uh, bottom the, up like uh, that. I don't know if like the original Deadpool one does that. I think it's only this one. But I don't know. I'm, but you know, it's going to be a fun and very funny Monopoly because it is Deadpool. Ice cream. Ice cream. You scream. We all scream for ice cream. So this is a card game. Um, About ice cream. Ice cream. So. Look at split family fun. Yeah. I'm, get, I'm not exactly sure what it's uh, what it's about um, as far as the, the whole concept of it, but uh, there we go. That's, I guess we saw, shall the see. First looks are for. Huh? Okay. All right. We'll put this over there. Huh? I don't trust you yet. No, I see that. I see right I saw it. Yep. starting to move real slow. Yeah. I, I had that spotty. All right, sensor. so he's got a, a pad mini. A pad oh, interesting. You got a smaller. Uh... Designed for comfort. Hmm. Huh. We'll see, how that, we'll see how that. Is something smaller really comfort, though? Because you're like. I don't know. Depends the, on depends on how the button configuration is. If it's yeah. easier for your thumbs to be able to touch, because some of the configurations on some of these, uh, if you look at it, the stretch and everything yeah. for it. So this so, is probably more like relaxed games. Definitely not something for one of those battle yeah, games like you don't want to play Smash. I'm sure you don't want to play Smash Bros. with that. You probably want to play something uh, like. Um, uh, Something relaxed like uh, 
one of the Mono- yeah one of the board or, games uh, pinball, pinball or one Wheel of, of Fortune or something like that you know smaller games or maybe like pool a, a game that some billiard table use a lot of flexing with the thumbs not and stuff. for like Fortnite and things like oh, that oh no definitely not that and classic pop the pig now, there's a- That might be Kevin Sinner's channel. Who knows? Uh, At some point, yeah. Simon, a uh, uh, pocket Simon. So it's a pocket Simon? Yeah. That's why it's smaller. Micro series, yeah. Oh. Huh. Oh, apparently I already messed up. There, watch the lights. Remember the colors. And then it. So what? What? There's two. There's a multiplayer. It said solo and something else. Okay. So there's something else to this Simon. Yeah. Okay. So we got him this. A pooter. Uh, 15, uh, 15.6 inch laptop computer for his, uh, for editing purposes and, um, planning and all that stuff for the channels and all that stuff. Mm-hmm. So he's got this now, so. Uh, possibly some upgrades to the content cool and such with this core cool edits and everything. So it's a gift to you guys as well. So you. it's a gift that keeps on giving, so there to speak. You go. So yeah. we got it for a good cause because he he was doing all of his um, editing. He didn't know, but he did it all his editing on that plus start on his phone, mm-hmm. which probably wouldn't have known that had I not told you. But since he's got this now, he can even enhance his yep. editing skills with this new laptop that he's got now. Yeah, but it, it keeps you off the phone for a while because when something's processed and you, you can't touch it at all. Yeah, so it kind of helps. You have that going on. You can keep your phone from being so bogged down. So, Except when you get those important calls and you're like, hey, yeah. oh, I'm and sorry. <laughs> I can't do another right now. We also got um, the LED light up. An LED mouse light pad. up mouse pad. There we go. You plug that it was surprised. I was surprised to where I found that. <laughs> mm. uh, yeah, it's really nice. It has it's different cool. modes. Nice and bright. It's actually... Here, here. It fell off the table. Here, here mousey, mousey. Yeah, I'll go over your tower. It's pretty long, pads. too. It's really long. So. Then it has the... Along the edges, different modes to it, so... Yeah. Not bad. Yeah. The Globe Star. If you like... Brain teasers. This is Illusion the one for you. Teasers. We, yeah. we might. We might. No, no, no. We might. We might do that on the channel. I don't know yet. We'll see. Try different. Yeah, try different teasers. But I like this one over here. I call it the the coronavirus ball. <laughs> get it out of the ball cage. Ball sphere. I see. That does look interesting. So I guess you gotta try and get it out of that. The wooden puzzle. Yeah. Uh. Cylinder thing. Okay. And then my passport. So that is his external hard drive, so he can actually hold uh, more videos. At hold one time. his videos on that and not bog down his computer as much. So there he's you able to, you know, if he's still got projects, whatever, he can put all his projects on that and not completely blow out his whole entire uh, storage storage <laughs> on the computer itself. Wireless noise earbuds. Oh, cool. cool. And then we got another Uno, Uno flip. flip. So, yes. Well, you know that's the thing with having so many, so many games. You know, it's and every, you got yeah, people they, giving it to you. They can't remember be if you've got yeah. it or not. When Best the collection tip. gets such. S- subscribe, hit the bell, you'll be notified what games we do. There you go. Yeah. It's uh, the third Uno flip. <laughs> yeah, third and Uno flip for the collection. So. Spinner. Is that a fidget spinner? Fidget spinner. Oh, wow. Trying. It's like a ceiling fan. The way that looks, you know? Back in, <laughs> back in my day, like we had those, ceiling fans as yeah. fidget spinners. It's one of those f- funky ceiling fans. I always call them funky ceiling fans when they're Metallic. squared up like that. You Metallic. Know? Yeah. Nintendo cards. Ooh. It's new games for that new model. Okay, so this actually... This came out of one of the old Spice packs. I was like, wow, that's so cool that they give you some playing cards. But yeah, you got the, the shampoo, the conditioner. Oh, 
Yeah, and then, throw one a deck of cards in there. Right <laughs> that, three deck of cards. 52 cards of barber-inspired hairs. Oh, God. That's cool. It kind of promotes some hair <laughs> on some bank cards. It's awesome. Oh, I can't wait to break that open and see the different hairstyles that yeah, happen there. Just, <laughs> well, that would be such a confusing video. Like, just you guys just see this, like, Old Spice cards? Is there okay? Well, what? Well, First thought when I seen that box fall out or that box falling out of the old Looks space like box, I was like, "What? Why do we have a royal crown box of cigarettes? Yeah, cigarettes, old <laughs> cigarettes, old spice cigarettes, or, or not royal crown, but uh, what is it called? Uh, camels or whatever it is. Yeah, it's like they're opening old spice <laughs> cards. Huh? It's fun. What yeah. was that? What? Why do we? Oh, cowboy McNugget. Yeah. You guys remember the old days of when McDonald's had all those characters. Right. So it was nice. The McNuggets and Ronald. I'm gonna add that to the McDonald's Grimace. section of our of his collection. More oh. Harley. The breast cancer awareness Harley Quinn. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, it's a whole line they came out with. Let me tell you, Batman doesn't look good in pink. <laughs> That one right now. I'm like, why? Why did you make? Why I mean, you... I, I understand it's for a good cause, but at the same time, Batman does not look good in pink. Yeah. Some of those, some of those, some of those, I'm like, that shouldn't be a figure. You know? Batman in pink does not just go together. No. no. Yeah. Like Superman in pink. I'm like, yeah, just, <laughs> just leave it to leave it to Harley. Just leave it blue and red alone. Yeah. Just, just don't. All right. This. I've been entertained for hours. It's, it's like a spinner and a puzzle and the, the middle spins. It's, oh. It's, it's amazing. But this, this kind of gets annoying here. You're trying to spin it and it just stops. I'm, I'm eventually probably just going to tear that off. I don't want to. But I mean, it gets I in the way you when you're that, spinning. I didn't realize. It gets in the way while you're trying to spin was. it. Oh, it's That's gonna mess up my OCD because there's mixed up beads and everything now. That's why you solve it. Ah, it's also a puzzle. No. Ah, I see what you said. It's a puzzle. It's a, a fidget. It's like a fidget puzzle. Fidget spinner Rubik's thing. ball thing. Yeah. There you go. Oh, okay. Coming so he's got some really cool. Uh, coming to a store near you. There clothing you. wear, I guess. Who are you gonna call? Ghostbusters. So this is a silhouette, Ghostbusters. Um, if you go t ghost. I say a silhouette because you can't see their eyes. Yeah. So, and I don't know the defect or that's just what they went with the design they went with, but. Uh, and then we got another no ghost. This is just the ghost and mobile. And then the Ecto one down there. Ecto one. Amazing store. Ghostbuster fan, if you couldn't tell, if you or... can't tell, he likes Ghostbusters. I don't know. Strange really noises in the middle of the night. But... Have a problem? Have a ghost? We are ready to believe you. Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. That's kind of cool. <laughs> more Harley, more awesome. So he got this hoodie. Harley Quinn. It's a thinner. Uh, it's not a real thick. Hoodie, but it's a really nice which I didn't know hoodie. till today it's it's double sided and it has the same on the back I didn't know that <laughs> oh yeah front and back it's the same artwork so you're not going to miss anything if you're putting it on backwards or anything like that, so. <laughs> and, until yeah, you when know you put it on hoodie, when right. you put it on after you open it I was like he's got that on backwards oh, kind of really? realize, but then yeah you buy a turn around right and... there oh it's it's a uh, double sided would be cool if it had the back of it there you go yeah that would be cool if, cool uh, detail if they had that and it's got this really cool Prince, Prince Nothing shirt. compares to you. Now that's a silhouette. Yeah, That's more of a silhouette. As I said, I, can't, I don't know if that's considered a silhouette or not because you can't see your eyes. So mm. You can see their face and everything, but... Uh, oh, this is a, a classic Harley Quinn, I guess you could the say. The Jester Harley Quinn. The Jester Quinn. version of her. There's so many different versions of her now. There we go. And that concludes. I mean, you got the stocking stuff. Yeah, you got the candies and 
Oh, we got those down there. Oh, there's so two those more games. games too, but yeah, they just yeah. a bunch of candy things. You got them Skittles and yeah. the Sour Patch Kids. I had kids. some stocking stuff as well. Candy, yeah, M&M's. Basically candies and... Oh, I got a wallet. <laughs> a wallet too, yeah. Got a wallet, a couple belts. You know, just basic things that you get. Uh, yeah, I like the Nutcracker Pez. It's cool with oh, a bunch of different holiday theme or themed flavors. Mm -hmm. And some classics like grape in there. But sugar cookie? Sugar cookie Pez. Interesting. What? It's a whole collector tube there. Yeah, yeah sugar cookie Pez. There it is, right hmm. there. flavor. So, another one of those. More of a. It's the same design. This one just has more Pez and stuff. Yeah, in it. same Nutcracker Pez. Same canister, I guess you could say. Pez dispenser. It's more like a collector's one, I guess. Yeah. More, more flavors. More flavors and things. So, this is a cool series, the Rustic series. Sorry, I like this, how it just pops open right there. Nice wooden box. Yeah. And cool look on the back. Mm -hmm. um, faded looks like a workshop. Yeah, looks like it's been uh, custom made, homemade, um, weathered, and whoa, whoa! Your your whole staff just shifted right there when and you bent over. The clue and version of that. A rustic clue. Right, same and style. That's nice. So that'll be interesting to see. Yep, one uh, murder, six suspects. A classic clue. They also have a couple of other games in that. Yeah, uh, Scrabble, Battleship, Monopoly. Yeah, in that set of games. There's a tease so. to an upcoming series on the. Possibly, yeah. Channel. Quite possibly. But there we go. That that pretty much concludes. Um, oh, more candy. Got some extreme sour. You guys seen that on this channel? Oh no! Extreme New sour intense candy. flavor. What? Oh, oh, we're about to come back to the Extreme That's Sour like, Challenge. Oh, no. What is this flavor? What? Blue raspberry, watermelon, lemon. North Poles. Black cherry and apple. Warhead Challenge. Challenge your taste buds and your friends and relatives with my intensely sour colored on and see if you can last until the sweetness underneath. Ooh. Some Laffy Taffy with them jokes. I like the jokes on there. Then, yeah, computer case and mouse as well. Yeah, you got a computer case and a mouse. Uh, so, maybe they'll keep this mouse. Carrying case. Yeah. They keep this computer safe and everything. Well, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you, everyone. Uh, yeah, so we have quite a few. Uh, Fun gifts to, uh, oh yeah, and his um, Chester Cheetah, Chester Cheetah, Cheetah Bones Bucket, Bones Bucket, yeah. Huh. Um, but yeah, so we got some content coming up. <laughs> As if you didn't know, we already had content coming, but now we even have more lined up now, or. In the planning stage, more or less. Yeah. We haven't put anything on paper or in, in motion to do any of those. But there's a lot coming your way, so stay tuned for that. So yeah. Some sooner th rather than later. Check so. out the other channels if you do not yeah. subscribe. A lot of it's coming your way. All the video games and board games featured in here are going over there. So. This is cool about the other channels, kind of it ties in all together, but like some of them are like exclusive and exclusive to other channels. You gotta go over there, check it out. Yeah, they all tie together. All of our channels tie together in some way, some form, some fashion, you know. Yeah. So, pretty interesting stuff happening. Mm -hmm. So make sure you've got all of our channels subscribed, liked, and you ring all the bells and all the channels and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, uh, that's pretty much it. Um, yep. 
Come say we go. We just goodbye all of them back to the North Pole. They all no, gathered together send, to wave goodbye. Send them all off to the North Pole here soon, and uh, we'll be rolling in the new year here soon. New year, and then going straight into our winter fest. Yeah. So Sammy, more of Sammy's still coming up. He's staying, staying with us for the winter. I thought I was a gutter. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite. You still got some time. It's still cold and winter stuff. So yeah, and you're, you're definitely hanging tight with us for a while. Yeah. Just with all your your uh, Christmas friends. And so Everyone totally, else got to go back and plan for the next. I mean, yeah, it's Christmas. Go back to the workshop and just take his elves and all that stuff, you know. So and everybody else that comes along from the North Pole has to head back. But anyway, that's pretty much it. That's that's what we got for Christmas this year. Uh, minus a few small, minor things like clothes and what have you. Um, things I wouldn't make you click off the video. <laughs> yeah, so we we want to try to keep it uh, interesting and fun for you. So by showing you all the cool stuff, the cool stuff, the cool stuff. <clears throat> uh, but anyway. Yeah, it's like, oh yeah, a new board game, can't wait for that video. Oh, okay, yeah, close, yep. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. an interesting video right there. Can't wait till they do a review on that. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, there you go. This year's Christmas haul. Um, yeah, so. wait to get into those games for my switch and mm -hmm. try them out but anyway i'm still getting used to the control uh layout for the switch because <laughs> i'm not used to that you know I, i've grown up playing you know playstation and xbox and i'm on the switch now so i'm like oh you're gonna see i'm playing i'm playing like i've been playing the the wrestling game and i'm trying to you know beat the guys in the game biggest thing like, i hate not used the a and b button are yeah. inverted so get used to that yeah I'm so I you, there is really no getting used to it there's there is no getting used well, to it i just it. have to remember that they're not in the same spot as I've, the other controls i've had, I've know, had so. sw switch four years now and still you're still go <laughs> because when you're an Xbox player, and yeah. Also, the Switch player, it's like you, you got to deal with the annoying B and A or different. Everything's like inverted on that. They switched them out, so I, I I've been trying to to do something on the game, and it's like I'm getting attacked. I'm like, why am I not being able to block? Jump, I'm like, jump, oh, jump. the wrong button. Oh, I'm pressing B, not A. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pressing A, not B. That's why I'm not. The jumping. screen says press B. I'm trying to press B, but I'm pressing the Y button instead. Yeah. <laughs> the A button. It's like, no, I'm in the wrong button. But, yeah, I have to... Yeah. Retrain myself. You know, if I just picked it up and start playing it, uh, and that was the only thing I was playing, then I would be able to really get my, my button coordination down because I don't just stick with the Switch. I play the Xbox, and I play the Switch, and I play... Uh, the 360. And, and, mainly and, just the and, B&A button. <laughs> you know. You know. We haven't done it yet, but possibly PlayStation on the channel, you know. Mm -hmm. I've played PlayStation personally uh, before the channel birthed and everything, but we don't have the PlayStation set up uh, for our channel yet. Gaming channel, so... Well, maybe it could be done in the future. Mm -hmm. uh, if Sony wants to sponsor I mean, us Sony, I don't know. Right, Sony. Uh, <laughs> anyway, we're just still upcoming channel. Mm -hmm. uh, channels coming up in the, in the YouTube world and all that stuff. So. Anyway, um, yeah, as far as the board gaming and the uh, uh, gaming channel, I guess we got some content coming for it. Yeah. Eventually. Uh, Try to work on the the quality of the gaming channel. Mm -hmm. uh, work on that some more, obviously. And try to give it some more love and attention and bring that up to par. Because we really worked hard on this. Now it's time to share the same love and spread the wealth, if you will, for the other channels. Mm -hmm. So maybe some more 
all around love this coming um, year, maybe, maybe instead of focused on getting stuck on one channel because so much content getting poured out. But not a bad thing, not a bad thing. Not complaining, not complaining. Had a lot of fun, but anyway, uh, anyway. I guess that's pretty much it. Yeah, we're, we're at the end of, end of the line right there. Mm -hmm. End of the rope, so to speak. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit and, uh, hit that bell. And if you're on Twitch. Follow us on Twitch. You underscore me gaming. You can chat, interact with us, and be featured in the YouTube videos. And be put on the leaderboard and the viewer board. Shout out. Uh, Daily Spartan. Lot Ogre. Plato underscore gaming with an eight. K California. Cage Alex Nine. Sleuthful. And then the leader Twitch board stands as follows. Kane is still at number one. I don't know how he does it, but he always has that spidey sense as we call it and, and somehow figures out that he's about to, about about to lose his throne and he sneaks in right underneath the uh the nose, so to speak. Right as the comments. executor is about to quit. Yep. Fado Arms for Gaming at number two, who is still chopping at the bit. He's still biting at the heels, literally and figuratively, uh, of Kane there, trying to get to one and knock Kane out of his, his position. And then at number three is still Cage. Um... At this point, Cage could be erased and it'd be an empty spot. But we're keeping him at number three because nobody else has tuned in besides yeah. That's why Fatal. he's been there. Besides so, that's why he's still been there. He's safe, so to speak, until somebody starts tuning in. Uh, so, And then, of course, Cage is our moderator on Twitch. Thank you for everything you do for us. You are a true legend. I would say at this point I would say speaking of Twitch, but we don't we're not doing that anymore, are we? Nope. So it, we have to <laughs> the, shout out to Fatal Gaming and Kane who made it on the snow globe for the Christmas tree. They got a big game for us to play in a live stream. So yeah. yeah, that was only up until the Christmas Wonderfest ended. So, so the tree all set up. Um, for this, obviously. Mm. Um, so, they're all there so they can shoot, tell us uh, a game that they would like us to play. Um, obviously, if it's not one that we've played before, it'll, it will get a first look in review. Mm. And if it is one we played before, we will just play it. It's in there. So, depends on which game is picked. Um, there we go. So, I guess... only one thing left to do now. Power. Vloggers. Subscribe to join our next adventure. We'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.